Well, everyone is happy here at Old Trafford for the time being. I say that because the sun is shining brightly. My name is Derek Ray, and my commentary partner, as usual, is Stuart Robson. And getting ready for a potentially thrilling contest. It is Manchester United facing Milan. Well, it was a good start to the season, wasn't it, Derek? They'll be looking to repeat that today. And if they can make it six from six... Can he do it? And a goal. It was served up on a silver platter for him. Are back underway. And 1-0 it is. Let's see what happens next. Well, he's outplayed and outfought him. And they'll get ready for the throw-in. Teo Hernandez. On the ball, Rafael Leao. Excellent challenge. And quite simply, wide of the target. Pogba. An alert intervention. Rebic. And he read it well defensively. Splendid defending, and it needed to be. In a position from which they could potentially do a bit of damage here. Given away by Manchester United. Lorenzi. It's with Romagnoli. Really good high press. Now what can they do from here? Oh, big opportunity! And they couldn't add to their advantage. Well, that would have put them in complete control. He should have scored there. Jaden Sancho. It's with Alex Tellez. Pogba. Well read to put an end to that attack. Rashford. A chance to whip it in. However, up a dead end. Foiling them effectively. Good work to win the ball back high up the pitch. And with that, the attack fizzles out. Diaz. On the ball, Rafael Leao. Pogba. Sancho now. Bruno Fernandes. And space here on the flank. Chance to play it in. And it's gone in! The team's separated by two goals now. You cannot say they don't deserve it. Well, here's the replay, and it's a really inviting ball played into the box, begging players to attack it, which makes it a fairly simple finish in the end. It's a really good goal. So, 2-0 now. An effective challenge. Really a very poor ball. Well, as the stats confirm, Milan have controlled the ball. Yes, they've played well when going forward, but it's been their ability to regain the ball which has made them so hard to play against here, and it makes them such a good team. It's been a brilliant performance so far. Good work to win it back high up the pitch. The Rossoneri pushing forward with options available, but a good piece of defending to bring it to an end. 
in position here to protect the ball losing possession a bit easily Sancho well there's a textbook example of how to press the ball And he read it superbly. Ray Beach. Played into the centre. It could be. Well, they get the ball once more. Well, half-time almost upon us. And playing away from home isn't bothering them in the slightest. Stuart, how about your take? Yeah, they're playing really well here. They've controlled the flow of the game. They've won their individual battles and they've created numerous chances. Their only problem in the second half could be complacency, but I can't see that happening. He's going forward well here. Brahim. Tomori. Real chance. Oh, incredible save, and he snuffed out any sign of danger. Given away by Manchester United. And we will have just one additional minute. An important interception. And that will do it for the first half here at the Theatre of Dreams. Well, quite frankly, it's been a struggle for Cristiano Ronaldo, not having anything like the impact we would expect from a... And the ball is rolling again. The Rossoneri having already made a big first-half statement here. Is there to be a response in the second half? Teo Hernandez. Run it well. Diaz. And the keeper stretching to deny him. Who can he pick out? Well, you can't really head them any better than that. But the goalkeeper was up to the task. Well, a corner right on the back of the last one. And he clears the danger. Applying vigorous pressure. Chance to play it in. Oh, he's left his marker for dead. And still dangerous. Delivering it into the box. A terrific defending to stop them progressing. Far from a good pass. The Rossoneri pushing forward with options available. And reading it absolutely superbly. Corner kick forthcoming. And clearing it away. The referee knew that was foul play, but advantage it is. Low delivery into the box. Something to worry about here. He's foiled them on his own. Thirty minutes left for play. Manchester United throw in here. Lindelof. 
Bruno Fernandes. And a really single-minded piece of defending to make sure nothing untoward happened. Couldn't keep the ball. United have it once again. Not a good pass. Well, they've won possession back. What can they do from here? Rebic. Oh, surely. Keeper getting the touch. Can he finish here? Great opportunity. And both hands on it. Good goalkeeping. Rashford. Pogba has it. Cristiano Ronaldo. Bruno Fernandes. Rashford. Diogo Dallo on the ball. It certainly wasn't a clean tackle. The referee has got to book him, I think. Ficayo Tomori. A reminder, the food stands will be open after the game. If you'd like to get yourself some post-match... They've regained possession. And that came off the defender, so it'll be a corner. CA and a struggle to get it away properly and he takes on the shot no difficulties encountered by De Gea and that was a very fine read and a bad pass it was promising attack but his timing was off and time for the change now. Number 10, Bahim, coming onto the pitch. Number 33, Rade Krunic. Substitution. There's 10 minutes remaining here. Coming off the pitch, number 6, Diogo Dallo. To be replaced by number 17, Fred. Given away by Manchester United. Cristiano Ronaldo has given it straight to the opposition and the counter looks on here options available will it be sufficiently imaginative still could put it away and that is how to block Scott McTominay and the quality of pass needs to be a bit better read it superbly to take back possession tremendous ball played through and there it is that will put the seal on victory if there were any lingering doubts Well, here's the replay, and it's a really inviting ball played into the box, begging players to attack it, and it ends up with a fairly simple finish. Certainly not much the goalkeeper can do about that.
This is looking rather comfortable for them. 3-0. Now we can say it's final, and we can say that Milan have officially prevailed.